if you see. I'm trying to deal with here tied off to this log back here branch when it keeps pushing me and I'm trying to keep myself stable by holding this branch too dying down but it picks back up and then it starts blowing me all around. Hoping you see this bite. Oh you won't see it. I ain't got GoPros like everybody else. I just got my phone. It's the poor man cat new poor woman. Life went out there that's dancing all the heck. I thought someone hit the cut bait. <laughs> Moving back up to the first spot. Clouds are starting to darken up. The wind is too hard there. Over here, I think the wind's a little less. I don't know how it looks like it's blowing. Well, once I get set up, come back on. Same spot, different tie off. And Possibly a little less wind here. I can see the wind blowing over there. This water has been staying kind of calm. So. Got a little front coming through, like I said. The skies are darker over there. Looking on the radar, looks like most of it will miss me. But with the wind, and how I usually tie it up, you know, it goes back and forth, back and forth on a strong wind, especially if I'm on the freeway. I'm kind of worried about that. Um, I don't know if I should stay till after. I only got two pieces of bait left though, or two live ones left. And the rest of my stuff, well, I got this tiny little piece here. But usually I don't get no bites on that. It's been the heads. But. Let me show you. Hold on. I got... I'm in 10 feet of water. Bank is right there. Up against this log. I would drop something straight down, but I'm out over that way. This, it, I don't know, it's, it's like I said, I think I said it's about 15 feet or so, and there's stuff down in there structure trees and stuff get hung up in there real easy today though I haven't yet but I think when I threw that line out I think it landed on something I'm not sure seen that branch right there coming down the river and it's looked like 
catfish whiskers sticking up. Well, it was going to be a monster. Well, the temperature has definitely dropped. So I think a slight little front just come through. I think that's why they was hitting so good, but now they're they're not hitting at all. I think I had one tap. But other than that, don't look at my nose. I know I give you bad camera angles, but let's see, it's 607. It's gonna be time for me to start loading up. I can't even stay long. I may go out tomorrow though, because I had a small job this morning. And that got me in the thinking mode. And then the lady for tomorrow, she already canceled the move to Thursday because of the storms that's supposed to get here. I don't know, they may be getting here early. But, I may go out. I may have to go try to get some more bait here. But that's another reason I want to get you taken off. So, probably give this about another five minutes. If I don't get nothing, then I'm going to start loading up. And that will be the end of it. Unless I catch something here within the next five minutes. See you later. A little incline that I got to come up. Not too bad, but right. now I gotta put it all together. Take it back apart. Move it up another hill. And into the truck. Hiking up a slight incline. All the way to the end of the thing there, so.